Starting with the great name of Allah, the most gracious and the most merciful, myself at the Shamameed and welcome to my YouTube channel Computernetic Zone for another exciting lecture. In today's lecture, I will be discussing about digital and analog signals. So what are analog signals? The, the continuous signals in the waveform is called analog signals or signals that is in the form of continuous wave is called analog signals. So you can see here, so this is a continuous wave that is moving. So this is an example of a representation of analog signals. So we have few examples like light waves, like sound waves and radio waves. Whatever we speak, whatever we speak is a sound wave and sound wave is an example of analog signal. Radio waves to radio transmission whatever your radio transmission you have is also an analog signal so light waves is also an example of analog signals the transfer of data from one place to another place in the form of analog signals or a continuous wave is called analog data transmission so we have example like telephone lines whatever we speak is sound waves is analog data transmission whatever we the data moves from through telephone lines is an example of analog signal or an analog data transmission the data transmission to a microwave system is an also example of analog transmission system and to satellite communication the satellite communication the satellite Whatever the transmission between the satellites is an also example of analog data transmission. So when someone asks you that what kind of data is uh, flow through the telephone lines, microwave system, or a satellite, you can simply answer that in analog data. The next one we have is a digital signal. It is a type of a signal that basically operates on two numbers 0 and 1 so the data communication the signals that depends on that operates on two numbers 0 and 1 to binary numbers 0 and 1 is called digital signals so computer accepts and processes data in the form of digital signals so you can see here one zero one zero one zero one zero so the digital signals in the form are in the form of zero and one so the transfer of data from one place to another place in the form of digital signal is called digital data transmission so the classic example of data transmission digital data transmission is modem it is basically the combination of two different um, mechanisms that is modulation and demodulization mo stands for modulation and DEM stands for demodulization. So modula modulation is a basically a conversion of digital to analog signal. If you want to convert that digital signal into analog signal, this is a modulation. And if you want to convert analog to digital, then then that would be uh, demodulization. So basically, the mod modem is is the conversion of digital to analog. And analog to digital signals so that's that's all for today if you like this video you can share it if you have any questions you can ask in the comment section I will definitely respond there and uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel you can subscribe it so you can get more updates you can get more videos in future thank you and have a nice day